Hey, what's going on everybody? I've got something here that I've been prototyping and I want to share with you guys uh, with the MetaHumans and the Oculus uh, OVR lip sync technology. So I've merged the two and I wanted to show you uh, where I was able to get with it. You know, we're sitting here. You and I are like a couple of regular fellas. You do what you do, I do what I gotta do. And now that we've been faced to If I'm there and I gotta put you away, I won't like it. But I'll tell you, if it's between you and some poor bastard whose wife you're gonna turn into a widow, brother, you are going down. Well, it's pretty cool. I think that's uh, looking very realistic. Um, the cool thing is, is I haven't animated anything. Uh, I haven't voice acted anything. I liter literally, um, once I've uh, done a bunch of programming here in the back end to connect uh, the systems and layered my own uh, emotion system on top of it, um, you can just drag and drop uh, audio files on top of this and just get it working. So let me just demo that super quick. So I've got this other meta human here and I'll just click on here. I'll change out the audio file to uh, I got a bunch of ones here that I just downloaded from different uh, movie scenes or whatnot. I think there's one from Goodwill Hunting. Let's use that one. Da, 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 da. Uh, the one the one thing to keep in mind as I'm demoing this is I haven't edited the audio clips at all. So you've got multiple characters talking and things like that. Um, obviously in a production uh, sequence, you would separate out the characters voices um, and things like that. but and also edit the audio so that there isn't background noise and things like that that are uh, interfering with it. But uh, let me just show you how it's working regardless. I thought about what you said to me the other day about my painting. Oops. Uh, Stayed up half the night thinking about it. Something occurred to me. I fell into a deep, peaceful sleep and I haven't thought about you since. You know what occurred to me? You're just a kid. You don't have the faintest idea what you're talking about. Why, thank you. It's all right. You've never been out of Boston. Nope. So you can see that I literally just dragged on a second clip. I didn't do any special configuration uh, with those clips. I just loaded them in. And then you used um, Oculus's um, uh, plugin uh, to create the lip sync sequence, and then using the programming that I put on top of this, it all just works uh, together. Um, so one of the things that I'm going to do is you can tell that the clips that I'm focusing on right are very serious tone. And so that's the uh, emotion that I've put over top of it. But I'm thinking of, you know, if I can categorize a dozen different emotions, I can then, um, you can just drag and drop the emotion set on top of it. And then if, you know, there's a happy scene, you'll, you'll have expressive, eyes and, and a happy face. If it's sad, we can we can change the emotion for that. If someone's angry and yelling, we can do that. But for now, I've got this working, uh, like I said, as a prototype uh, for serious scenes. Um, the other thing that I've done, um, just to show you, well, actually, I haven't done anything, is I've just really loaded on um, uh, pre-done animation. So with your Mixamo or your pre-existing animations, um, this will work together uh, in tandem. So on the body, uh, I just literally just dropped in a different animation. Um, we'll go to the main character here. We'll swap out the audio like I did before. And I'll just show you another clip here. Uh, whoops. Um, and show you how simple this is to use. To me, it's just a made up word. A politician's word, so that young fellows like yourself can wear a suit and a tie and have a job. What do you really want to know? Am I sorry for what I did? Well, I am. There's not a day goes by I don't feel regret. 
Not because I'm in here, because you think I should. I look back on the way I was then. A young, stupid kid who committed that terrible crime. Says to him, tell him the way things are. But I can't. That kid's long gone, and this old man is all that's left. I gotta live with that. Rehabilitated is just a bullshit word. So you go on and stamp your form, Sonny, and stop wasting my time. Because to tell you the truth, I don't give a shit. Such an awesome quote. Uh, I love, I love that movie. Uh, what is that? Shaw, Shawshank Redemption, and uh, yeah, just a an awesome part of the movie. Um, anyways, I, you know, I, I kind of got lost in there. Um, like that felt really good. I mean, there are some things. Um, I think the uh, one of the lip curls underneath is is a little bit too pronounced. There's a few things that we can fix. There's still a little bit of stuttering, stuttering where it doesn't quite feel realistic, and I think there's opportunity to um, build in some lerp uh, lerp animation uh, and just make the, uh, the the change in facial expressions just a little bit smoother. Um, I'll show you quickly, kind of behind the scenes. Uh, where this came from. Uh, Oculus has this lip sync plugin. To me, it's just a made up word. A politician's word. So that young fellas like this. So you can tell um, Oculus released this with 425. They did a decent job with it, but um, I don't think they fully took it to the next level. And they sort of just left uh, the bare bones. And that's what I used to uh, construct this. They didn't port 425 over to 426. I had to do a little bit of engineering to figure out how to get it into 426. I haven't tested it with 5 yet, um, but I'm confident that we can get it over there. Um, so I used that. That's the that's sort of the bare bones of this. And then this is really um, uh, just layered over top of the, um, the animation blueprint. So here's sort of uh, the rat's nest of code <laughs> that I played with here. I'm going to clean this up so it's a, a lot cleaner, so it's easy to understand. Um, and same thing with the uh, animation graph, uh, just a whole bunch of different uh, nodes that needed to be connected to sort of make this work. Uh, a lot of trial and error to sort of figure out um, what works. I think I've got uh, a decent uh, map there. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, you know, this isn't something, I, I've put a lot of demos on my channel, but this is something a little bit more uh, complicated um, to demo all of this, I think would, would be pretty long. Um, so instead, I'm thinking of, you know, maybe I'll just make a plugin and, and release it. I haven't really thought out in detail uh, how I'm going to release that yet. But uh, yeah, I was thinking of packaging it up in a plugin and getting it out to people. Um, yeah, I really kind of wanted to test and see if there's interest out there. I was working on uh, a, a clothing um, system before, but I don't think there was a ton of interest. This, maybe there's a little bit more interest. So just sort of gauging interest, seeing if this is something that... Uh, folks want me to continue with and um, if they would want it released on the, the, the marketplace or uh, to set up a patron or, or something like that um, to finish the project. Uh, so yeah, that's really what this is. Um, I, I'm really impressed with, uh, with where I got it so far um, and uh, I hope you guys like it and um, we'll see where we can get to and maybe this is something we can get out to the community that'll help folks with uh, their projects. Anyways, uh, that's all for today. Um, stay tuned. I've got, I don't know, <laughs> at least two dozen different projects going on. So I've got some really fun stuff coming out. Um, this was just one that took my attention recently. And I'll just continue to pump out content. I know I still owe people um, some other metahuman content that they've been asking for on, on the page and whatnot. But I've only got so much time. And I'll just, uh, I've got it all. I've got a list of things i got to pump out. And I'll eventually get to it. Um, and... Uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Sure.